The two begin on this Friday morning, just as the Summit of the Americas is set to begin. Venezuela's president, Nicolas Maduro, announces that the campaign calling on the U.S. to repeal its decree against Venezuela has reached its goal of 10 million signatures. Now, speaking at a rally in Caracas Thursday, Maduro praised Venezuelans for embracing the campaign. He says it has forced U.S. President Barack Obama to acknowledge that Venezuela is not a threat to the United States as March's executive order states. Maduro, who was accompanied by Bolivian President Evo Morales, will meet Obama at the Summit of the Americas in Panama City Friday. There, he will present him with the millions of collected signatures. Maduro says Obama's backtracking on the decree could lead to better relations between the U.S. and Latin America. The statements by President Barack Hussein Obama could temporarily open a window to begin a new era of historic relations between Venezuela, a free and sovereign Latin America, and the empire of the United States, but based on respect and non-interference in our domestic affairs. Thousands from across Latin America marched Thursday at the 